Welcome back to It's Time for Beer. In this episode, I'm going to continue on with another fruit-accented beer, I guess we could call it. This is Sam Adams Grapefruit IPA, and it says, Brewed with real grapefruit for an added punch of citrusy goodness. In the last episode, I did New Belgium's Citradelic, and I was not pleased with that beer. It tasted like uh, beer-flavored fruit juice. This one is grapefruit instead of tangerine. It says, brewed with grapefruit peel and grapefruit juice. Let's get this in a glass and see what we got. Well, just like the New Belgium Citradelic, this is very hazy. We got lots of head, two solid fingers, and I tried to do a pretty light pour. I gave it a little bit of time to let the head settle down. Now let's see what this smells like. Honestly, it kind of smells like a Sam Adams Boston Lager, so at least they got that going for it. It doesn't look like it, but it smells like it. I'm not going to go through what the, the scents are that I smell in this thing and everything, but assume that if you've had a Boston Lager, that's what this smells like. So let's see what it tastes like. Ugh. That, just like the New Belgium, tastes like beer-flavored fruit juice. It tastes like beer-flavored grapefruit juice. Except this is actually stronger than the New Belgium Citradelic. It's got that grapefruit, like rind bitterness. This is much more potent, the, the fruit juice flavor. Which is odd because it still smells like Sam Adams Boston Lager. Yeah, that's, that's not good at all. So if you're into beer-flavored fruit juice, then this beer is for you. If you are not into beer-flavored fruit juice, and you're thinking that, hey, let me try that to see if the grapefruit is going to accentuate the hop character in that IPA. Just don't. Just stay away. It's, it's not good. This is... Uh, who came up with this idea? Hey, let's add fruit juice to the beer and see if it makes it taste good and accentuate the hops. It doesn't. It doesn't, not at all. So, if you think you might want to try these, just stay away from it because it is not going to be what you're expecting. It is going to be so much worse. With that said, drink what you like, enjoy what you drink, and I will see you next time. This is not what I enjoy to drink, and this is not what I like to drink. And I honestly don't think I'm going to finish this because this is really not good. If you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button below, and to see more beer reviews and homebrew tutorials, please hit the subscribe button.